Now let's look at a problem dealing with a normal distribution. According to the American freshman, the number of hours that college freshmen spend studying each week is normally distributed with a mean of seven hours and a standard deviation of 5.3 hours. Use the 68, 95, 99.7 rule to find the percentage of college freshmen who study between seven and 12.3 hours each week. We're going to sketch out a normal distribution so that we can see what we're dealing with. And we want to place right in the middle, dividing into two equal parts, our mean of 7. Now, let's go to our standard deviation. If we take 7 and add 5.3 to that, we come up with 12.3. Notice that that's the other value we're interested in in the problem. We're interested in discovering how many students are going to study between 7 and 12.3 hours. On our normal distribution, that would be represented by the area that I'm shading. Now, this is also one standard deviation above the mean. And we know that if we go one standard deviation in either direction from the mean, we're going to be able to use the rule which says that 68% of all scores will lie within one standard deviation. Because we have symmetry to the graph and we can see that we're working with half of this, we're going to take 68% Divide by 2 to give us 34% as our answer.